Hi, I'm Nick, and um, I'm here today at um, La Jolla Shores at 7 o'clock in the morning to demonstrate something to you. Now that thing is very important if you are going to go diving. The scientific law that I'm going to demonstrate is called Boyle's Law. It basically states that um, pressure and um, the volume of a gas um, are inversely proportionate, which means if one doubles, the other one decreases by two. The way I'm going to demonstrate it to you is by drowning these balloons. I'm going to sink them on a rope and place them at different depths in and see what changes are made. The things I'm going to use to help demonstrate this to you is um, my scuba gear and well obviously a camera but um, also these blow up mattresses that are 24 years old and um, yeah we're going to anchor them to the bottom and then we're going to use a line of this thingamajig and clip the balloons to it. The way we breathe underwater is through the regulator which is attached to compressed gas, but then here's a spare regulator, but it also um, controls the um, buoyancy compensator, which um, by the depth, uh, you need to increase the air inside of it to give you neutral buoyancy. Some of the gauges and thingamajigs that I have to um, sort of help diving is um, a watch to tell the time that I was under there and um, a depth gauge and um, the highlighted zone of it is when a normal 20% of oxygen which is in the air at sea level is, becomes toxic and um, there's a compass and then here is the pressure gauge, which tells me how much compressed gas is in my um, tank. This is a camera that we're going to use, and um, it's in its seemingly bulletproof case right now. And um, we will be using it to video or take pictures of the um, balloons over there, how they um, decrease in size.
made it out alive, but let me tell you that carrying a hundred pounds through like a five foot wave is not easy. So, I'm glad that it, it turned out really good and we lost nothing and the experiment went right, so bye. I don't get paid enough to do this.